Well, hello, Internet. Today, we're going to talk about trading time for money. There was a comment on one of my 30 days to $2,500 videos, and this is something that comes up over and over and over. Yo, what's going on? It's Glendon Cameron, founder of Hustlers Kung Fu, the launch pad for beginning business owners and baby hustlers. Here, you'll get the information where you'll learn how to make money. Some of it's for free, and some of it you gotta pay for. I don't wanna trade time for money. Well, here's the problem with that. For most people on this planet, they're gonna trade time for money. And for those who don't, they're going to trade time for money to get the skills to someday in the future not trade time for money. It is hard. It's not something that you can do with a low skill set. That's the problem. If you have a high skill set, if you are a creative person, if you are an inventor, things like that, yes, you can live that life of making money off of something you did once. I know you do not want to trade time for money. And I'm going to go ahead and use me because I traded time for money to learn how to not have to trade time for money. Currently, one of my income streams, I am trading time for money as a consultant. I'm an employee. So I don't know where all of you are getting this idea that you're going to go out and create this thing and not have to work anymore. There was this question that I answered on Quorum about this very thing. I'm 20 years old. How do I get a bunch of money where I don't have to work anymore? Okay, let, let me be real clear with you guys. Not wanting to waste time is fundamentally different than being lazy. It is not about being efficient. It's not about saving time. It's because you're fucking lazy and you don't want to work. And until you develop a good work ethic, you're not going to create a piece of art. You're not going to create a blog. You're not going to create a YouTube channel. You're not going to create anything that would allow you to have passive fucking income. It's not going to happen. Let's go ahead and talk about how you can actually build something where you are not trading time for money. I'm gonna start off with the things that I have done and know how to do, and I'll give you some theory stuff later. One of the reasons that I want to be a creator, and I am a creator, and I want to be a writer, is if you create something stunning, excellent, amazing, one piece of work, you can live off that for the rest of your life. It's possible. I tried to be a writer in 1991, didn't work out. I wanted to write that, you know, I had a little skill with the pen. I didn't have discipline. Then I tried it again when I was in the boarding house. I was doing this thing called Passionate Friday. It was had a list serve. Yes, that's a way long time ago. Then the third time, I had over a decade of business experience I was used to working 10 to 12 hours a day, month after month, year after year. So my third time, which I am still developing as a writer, as a communicator, as a video creator, I am still developing, I had a lot more discipline that came from working. You're not just going to develop discipline. Like uh, I have a writer friend, and I'm not going to mention her name because she's Googleable. She lost a writing contract because she couldn't finish the book. They gave this chick $150,000 advance, and she had to give it back because she did not produce the manuscript. All she had to do was write that book. She didn't have the discipline. She's a little flaky. You have people like this who, who do these things, but the first step to not having to trade time for money is to trade time for money. You got to go to work. You'll hear about this programmer or this kid who developed this app, but you will not hear about the 2,000 to 20,000 hours of being in that niche, playing those video games, tweaking that code. It's just like they snapped their fingers and they had money. What you got to do is get busy on something. I know I'm going to get it in the comments, and please leave it in the comment. No, it does not work like that. Your dissent that I don't know what I want to 
to do. Well, broke dick Danny, because you are broke dick Danny, because if you're not happy, you don't know what you want to do, you're not making any money, you're broke. You need to pick something. You need to make a commitment to something. And this is the thing, the commitment doesn't have to be for life. It could be for 30 days, it could be for 60 days, it could be for 90 days, and you'll start to find some things out. But as long as you're like, look, G, before I do anything, I need to know if this shit's gonna work. If you think like that, you might be 70 years old with a pocket full of regrets. The second step is to become good at whatever you're committed to. You want to seek out excellence. You don't want to be good. You want to be excellent. You, you want to strive for being the best. You want to be so good that people just take notice, even if they're not interested in your stuff. They're like, you know, I'm not really into porn, but his left stroke is, it went viral. You, you got to get that level of proficiency. You, you have to. Whatever. Now, I know there are many people who's like, Glendon, tell me what to do. I'm not your daddy. I'm not your mama. And more than likely, your daddy and your mama told you to do some stuff, but you didn't want to do it because you didn't like it. Ding. Hit back to my other point. You need to figure some stuff out because you as a carbon-based life form will not put out for something you don't want to do. Everyone's like, I don't know what I want to do. You know what the fuck you don't want to do. So how do we use those two truths? First of all, you will create a bunch of experiments. And I don't wanna hear like, I ain't got time for that. You ain't doing shit right now. You're not. Pick some stuff that you are mildly interested in and construct a 30 day lab, a 60 day lab, a 90 day lab. Very quickly, you will start to find out like, eh, I can't do this for a year. You'll know. There's something that you could do, you know, it, it doesn't have to be the best thing ever. It doesn't have to be your most, you know, it, it doesn't have to wake you up in the morning. For some reason, the video in my car cut out, so I just had to come home. It didn't have to be some that you were in love with, but you've got to take some chances. You have to experiment. Otherwise, you're going to be forever chasing your tail. What you see is focus. You see how there's only concentration on the flowers and everything is kind of blurred out. That's what you got to do with whatever you're trying to do. You've got to focus. Hands down, this is probably one of the biggest problems. People who are trying to escape the trading time for money paradigm is a fundamental lack of understanding that you got to do it until you can do better. Most of us are gonna have a direct exchange of time and energy for money in terms to earn stuff, money, food, whatever, depending around where you are in the world. That's what you're gonna do until you can do better. You need to perfect making money in maximizing your dollar for your hour of work. And then once you get a higher income, once you start to do that kind of thing, then it gets easier to put things in place that your money's working for you because you have some money. You have assets that are making money when you're not actively working. That sets you on that path, but you just can't leap from broke dick Danny status to I got money coming out my ass. It's just not going to happen. For those of you who want to escape this paradigm of trading time for money, the best thing you do is to start a business. In the beginning, you will be trading time for money but you'll be trading time for more money. Give me an example. Let's say you're currently making 15 bucks per hour, or let's say, let's say you're making $25 per hour, which is $50,000 a year. If you could move your hourly wage to $250, you are still trading time for money, but you're making five times as much money in the same hour. Now this will put you on the path to leaving trading time for money because now you have more money to invest in things that can free you. This is the path. This is what I have done. This is what you can do. Uh, below the video is the offer, 30 days to 2,500. It's $299. If you go ahead and buy today, you will get as a bonus digital introductions. So it's like 50, 100 times your money. That's a deal. Links below, buy it today. And with that, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.